children welcome to the class of social studies children today i am going to teach lesson 16 e for environment the topics which we will discuss today are understanding the environment number 2 types of pollution number 3 measures to save our environment please open your book page number 138 children what do you mean by environment everything which is around us makes up our environment everything which is around us makes up our environment there are so many things in our environment some are living things and some are non living things living things are many in number like birds animals insects human beings there are also non living things such as houses buildings computers mobiles children our environment is both natural and man made air water animals plants trees these comprises these comprise on the natural environment and there are some things which are not natural like buildings cars computers these are the example of man made environment our environment is very precious and we must protect it but often we end up making it more dirty how can we do this human beings use and throw many uh, things some of the things goes back to the nature these are called eco friendly waste uh, for example uh, vegetables fruits they decay and enrich the soil but there are some other things like plastic tin which do not decay and it pollutes our environment children now let us study about the types of pollution to pollute means to make our earth dirty first of all let us study about air pollution children harmful and poisonous smoke that is emitted by the different vehicles like cars scooters bus etc pollutes the air and that is around us this smoke not only pollutes the environment but also affects our health burning of plastic or garbage also cause pollution even bursting crackers also causes pollution breathing in breathing problems may occur because of the polluted air people suffer from different diseases because of the polluted air now children let us study about water pollution throwing garbage directly into water bodies bathing animals washing utensils etc makes the water dirty and unfit for drinking this polluted water is harmful for the things which are there in the water marine animals like fish it may cause harmful effect to the fish drinking polluted water leads to many types of diseases now children let us study about land pollution land gets polluted by garbage trash from homes and industrial waste dirty water from sewage also cause causes land pollution 
land absorbs the polluted harmful things and in turn uh, reduces the fertility of the soil extensive use of pesticides and fertilizers also contamin contaminates the soil what are pesticides pesticides are substances which are used to uh, spray on the crops to protect them from pests fertilizers are substances usually chemicals which are added to the soil to increase the fertility the word contaminates means to make something impure so pesticides fertilizers are contaminating the soil by by entering into the soil which is present around us and in turn making the soil bad now children let us study about noise pollution any unpleasant sound which comes around disturbing sound can be termed as noise there are sounds of cars honking buses people speaking in loudly people selling their goods in the markets noise from industries and factories bursting of crackers all these sounds causes noise pollution noise pollution is harmful for us sometimes it can make us deaf so these are the different types of pollution now how can we save our environment children forests also are being cut for building houses roads factories all of us know that trees are very important for us because they make the air pure and healthy animals also have lost their home because of the cutting of forests animals are hunted for their skin to make different articles like bags clothes jackets belts etc children if we do not save our environment future generations will suffer because of it so we need to adopt some measure measures so that the environment can be saved there are different methods first of all use public transport like buses metros and carpools plant more trees so that we get fresh air and do not waste paper because paper is made from trees use eco friendly transports like cycles and cng vehicles stop using polythene bags and instead you can use cloth bags or jute bags switch off lights and fans when they are not in use do not burst fry crackers as they cause both uh, air pollution and sound pollution noise pollution car owners should take care that the smoke coming out from their car is not too harmful it is never too late to protect our mother earth we all can work together to keep our environment clean safe and clean we must work towards it children i hope you have understood today's lesson read the lesson well that's all for today thank you